Hey students, uh, what we're looking at here is the inside of an upright piano, the underneath of an upright piano to be more specific. Uh, we're looking at strings, hammers, and the iron plate, which forms the harp of a piano. And the strings cross over each other. So these are the bass strings, believe it or not. These strings here are this note on the piano. So this A here, that's that's this string right here. It's vibrating right now, actually. And uh, these other strings here are probably probably the F somewhere in there. And then there's little tiny strings up here, which are these guys at the very top of the instrument. This is my piano. It's an upright uh, Wurlitzer. It is a spinet, which means that it has a drop action. So what we're looking at here, let me see if I could, yeah, perfect. What we're looking at here, you see it moving? I'm pressing the key, and it's moving the hammer. Okay, it's moving um, this part here. As I depress the key, the hammer moves up and it strikes the string, and when I let go, it relaxes. This is called a drop action because these hammers drop down below the key bed. A direct action, the hammers are at the same level of the key, so they would hit like middle C, would hit right there, okay? But a drop action, middle C is below, the hammer itself is below is below the instrument. Pretty cool stuff. By the way, um, th this harp, this iron plate holds tons and tons and tons of pressure. All of these strings are under tension and tension holds their tune. Okay, so when a piano goes out of tune, what happens is the pins loosen. Okay, so there's pins on the inside of the instrument at the top. I'll show you in the next video. And when those loosen, the piano goes out of tune because the string becomes more relaxed, okay? So each string needs to be held at a specific tension in order for the instrument to keep its tune. Um, for example, the low A has the loosest tension. It's the thickest string, and it vibrates the slowest. But the high C, which you can't even see because the string's so small, this note here, these, these strings are the thinnest, and they're pulled the tightest, okay? And uh, and they vibrate more fast, more quickly. Anyway, so this is just an, a demonstration of what goes on the inside of an upright piano.